Hey everyone, welcome to League of Legends. This is uh, a game mode in League of Legends called Swarm, and it's basically vampire survivors with a League of Legends theme to it. So we have two Jinx characters, um, Zaya, I think is how you say her name, and um, I am Yazio. And I've been liking Yazio quite a bit. There's uh, a couple times where <laughs> I have forgotten to build crit, and, you know, if you don't build crit on Yazio, he is, like, probably 75% weaker than he could be. So, yeah, that, that sucks when you don't do that, but sometimes I'm not really paying attention. I'm just in, like, sleep mode for my last Yazio match, and, uh, yeah, I, I forget. But... Anyways, this time we're definitely going to get crit. And, um, this game starts out pretty easy. Right here's critical chance. Critical chance right here. This means it's going to evolve our Steel Tempest when we get the Steel Tempest up to, like, just level 5 and then level 6, um, we'll evolve it. And how do you know that? It says evolve, and it tells you exactly what you need. Crit chance. And right here crit chance or critical chance and it, it tells you any ability will tell you how it evolves and in order to evolve that ability you got to get that ability up to level six and you've got to have um the the passive that it needs so basically you're just matching cards so since yazio likes crit i like to get um it's the bunny shooter or something it's the crossbow and if you play this, you know what I'm talking about. And when you upgrade that all the way, you're shooting like basically 360 degrees. I don't know if it is 360, but it feels 360 degrees. And it's really nice. And that's that's what I go for usually on my go. And between those two items, you can build almost anything else that you want. Ability haste is nice too. But um, yeah, you can build almost anything else you want and you're gonna be god mode on Nagio. And for some reason tonight, the servers have been just lagging so bad. And I'm not the only one to notice. There's other people in here that uh, have said, is it lagging or is it just me? And it'll be lagging, and I'll look up at my MS up here in the top right. Right now it's 51, 41, 38. Usually when you lag, it spikes to like 200 or 300. But um, it's, mine doesn't. Mine stays at a... I think it's gone up to 70 before when I was lagging. It doesn't go up to like 500 or 600. It stays there, which tells me it's on the server side. It's not my connection. Um, okay. We want 30% more damage to distant enemies because Yajio hits things at a distance, especially in late game. Like right now, maybe not at a distance because things are getting close to me, but um, in late game, I will be hitting things at a distance. Uh, it, and the reason it pauses like this is because there's other people picking as you can see Jenks over here doesn't have a check mark like everyone else she's still picking a card she has 30 seconds to pick a card and when you level up and if she doesn't pick a card in that 30 seconds she doesn't forfeit the card I think the game just unpauses and you're still in the card select screen so you're basically you're shooting yourself in the foot if you just sit here see this timer right here I can let it run out but then you're, you're literally holding up the match for everybody else. I was in a match earlier, and there was a guy, I don't, I don't know. He got pissed off at one of the people, I forget what the character even was, but one of the people in my, on my team, he got pissed off because he was following him around. And he couldn't kill anything. So he got pissed off, and he started trolling, and he started waiting for that timer to get down to like five seconds. And just slowing the game down tremendously it was so annoying we ended up winning but like dude come on like the matches are 15 minutes when you get to this 15 when you get to the 15 minute timer you get to the boss fight and if you kill the boss yeah you win if you don't kill the boss boo you lose but um yeah there's supposed to be 15 minutes plus the boss fight so that's like five minutes maximum so the matches should be about 20 
a little over 20 minutes because you know you got the card picking screen and you got to wait a few seconds for the turn. It went well beyond 20 minutes. If I would bet it was like half an hour that we were sitting here playing that game, maybe even longer than that. It was it was awful. It was really awful. Uh, all right. We're not doing too much damage right now. I like that static sword. I don't know. I, I got Bangerain because we had the evolve already at evolve with movement speed. This evolves with crit. This evolves with crit. And then a Vortex Club, I guess I could go for uh, health regen. Just so that we're able to evolve that. But I don't know if you can evolve five items. I've never evolved five cards. The most I've ever evolved was three. And then it's like full build! And then the cards that you get to pick are like 25 gold or was it like 30% health heal or something? I don't know. Just survive while tiny. Oh god, yeah, you, you get you get one shot. I got out of there. Don't know how, but you basically get one shot when you're tiny like this. And it, it sucks. Now when you die in this game, um, yeah, your character goes down, and it says, you know, you're basically dead, but, um, you're, are a, you're able to get revived, we'll go with damage upgrade, right? not health regen, I, more damage is better, right, but you are able to get revived by another team member or your cooldown over here, like Jinx at 14 seconds, 13, 12, she'll revive after that timer's up, alright, we did it. We, uh, we stayed alive. Now a card dropped over there. As you can see on the mini-map down here, there's a card on the ground. And the card's gonna give you a free one of these cards. Let's go with this sea mine. I don't think I've built that before on Yajo. I've built it on other characters, but I don't think I've ever built it on Yajo. We'll see how it goes. Um, I'll let them pick the card up. It doesn't look like they're going to. Some people like to, like to let the cards sit on the map and then pick them up later. Maybe that's how you evolve five skills. I'm not sure, but as long as they're not picking them up, I'm not gonna pick them up. You know, whatever. Steel Tempest, we need that at level six, like, as soon as possible. Because once we get that up there, we're, we're strong boys. We're very, very strong boys. Okay, let's get moving to, these are bosses, these red dots on the screen. Um, all right, so let's get down here and try to take this boss out. There's two of them. Jinx, both Jinxes are on these. But I'm gonna go over to this one where uh, Gaia is. It's, it's basically a Cogman. It even looks like Cogman. I mean, you can tell it's not by looking at him, but it, it's pretty good. Okay, I hate these guys that shoot these guys. They're so annoying. Holy crap, they're gonna kill me. Okay. Let's grab this guy. If I survive to the health. I did not survive to get the health. What a defeat, man. How are both Jinxes dead? What the hell? I thought they were going to be fine. Alright, I'll grab this health. Because even though I... Well, I am going to need it when I stand up. But um, even though I grab it, it, it hits all my teammates. So everybody gets the heal. So it's really nice. Okay, crit's nice, but I need my Vortex Blade. Okay, area size, sure, but I want my horse. Right, let's go, let's grab this health because our jinx needs it. Um, go with this. Alright, the Yumi quest is this white cat looking thing on the screen. I'm gonna head that way. Because if you complete the Yumi quest successfully, you get a very nice upgrade. And I've gotten one of them already. If you hold down tab, it opens this menu. And this is what I've got. That 30% long range damage. Um, that was from a Yumi quest. Alright, speaking of damage, we just upgraded our damage by 10% more. And that, that's universal. Like, that upgrades the damage on everything. All your cards by 10%. Holy crap, there's so much stuff over here. I hope they're not picking up the Yumi quest right now. Okay. 
you guys want to calm down a little bit. All right, our Vortex Blade is level 4. We need it to be 6. Like, quickly. There's an upgrade up here. I can't get over there, but someone can hit it. I'm going to be dead when they hit it, so I'm not going to get it. Yeah, I don't. I don't know how I'm alive. I don't know how I'm alive. Oh, they got that upgrade, and I'm freezing anything. Okay, that's... Lucked out. Completely lucked out. Alright, can I kill this guy, please? Got him. There we go. Now our Vortex Blade is level 6. It's upgraded. Now, look at my tornadoes. My automatic attacks, how he was just shooting tornadoes out and they would, like, fire them to go around. Now, I'm just shooting like this. And it's pretty amazing. And that looks like it's gonna hurt. Catch the red dot. I wouldn't even pay me. Safety freaking red dot. I oh my god, I touched it. I'm I'm on it! Okay. Um let's go with one movement speed for every two haste. Our movement speed right now is 522. We hit this. It goes up to 549. That's nice. I like that. Alright, yeah, see how much stronger Yajo is? Like, all of a sudden, we're, like, extremely strong. Well, the monsters also got weaker. I know that. But, like, damn. And I'm just gonna set this guy behind the wall, and we're gonna burn him down a little bit. And then start running again. Like, he's gotta run through my tornadoes, and it's just annihilating him. I know we got jank helping, but, wow. Take down the chomper. We're gonna get dirty. And these guys are like little loot goblins from like Diablo. You kill them and they drop all this gold. And the gold you use, not in this mission, but like where you're selecting your hero, you have permanent upgrades that you can spend the gold on and like increase your movement speed, um, how many projectiles you shoot out, the area size, the damage, you, like, wow. You, you know, you can upgrade everything. And it sticks to your account. Not just your character, but your whole account. Ow, that hurt. Whoa. Okay. These guys shooting the balls are going to kill me. I, I'm having a hard time moving. I don't know if you noticed that, but he's jumping around a little bit. See how... It's like the frame rate just dies. What's my FPS and latency? So we're at 27. My FPS is down to 41. It might be on my side. I don't know. I, I can turn it down. Like the graphics. I'm getting 43 uh, frames per second. I had a cap at 60. But, you know, even if I was playing at 30 frames a second, I feel like it would be running smoother than that. But maybe not. Yeah, I'm back up to 60, and it's running fine, so it might be on my end. Could be. I'm not doubting it. It very well might be on my end. Um, I have a, you know, top-of-the-line graphics card, but there's, there's also a lot of shit going on in the screen. So, yeah. If it's on my end, actually, that's great, because it's an easy fix. If it's not on my end, then, you know, we got to wait for him to fix it. But I don't feel like I was lagging that time. But now all of a sudden I am. It just, it's really good. I don't know. My FPS is up. I'm trying my computer. Um, okay, let's see. Just the fact that other people are complaining that the game is lagging. Makes me think it's not my computer, but... If the FPS drops like that, I, uh, it tells me I can probably fix it temporarily at least by uh, dropping the graphics I don't know what the graphics are at whatever default is I'm just staying here with pink we're just doing everything you can just stay in here I mean this, this is it this is the game this uh, I know it it's great gameplay, breathtaking, 
my pulse is at a whopping uh, 62. So exciting. Um, let's go with this. The bunny blast. The bunny blast is. Um, You'll see it, maybe. It's a projectile that shoots down like a satellite, basically. Like a laser that shoots down from space and shoots stuff. But I think they're all out of range. And they can't get close enough for it to trigger. If I do not see it triggering, then this is gonna hurt. Okay. Yeah, Jinx is dead, because Jinx wasn't playing. <laughs> because we were literally standing there AFK. But Jinx literally got up, or she just wasn't paying attention. Which is freaking hilarious. I did not mean to grab that. Cause you can see there's some cards on the ground. I think they're trying not to pick them up, but accidents happen. Yeah, that drink is definitely AFK. He got up and walked away thinking, you know, oh good, I'm being protected. I'm gonna get up and get a drink. So he's got eight seconds, seven to pick a card, six, he picked a card, okay. Um, let's see, we'll do Ability haste, so we're, we're casting our tornadoes even faster now. I'm gonna pick her up as soon as I'm able to. I'm in a car. This is the, the power up that we got. The cars are awesome. You just one shit over here. Bam bam. I know, in a way it makes me feel like I'm weaker. Mostly because I'm not catching anything, but you're obviously stronger. You're literally running things over. Alright, you just evolved my mines. And area size went up, which affects the mines. I don't think it affects anything. Area size. Oh, it's the Mega Blast. Okay. Yeah, but that's it. Um, we'll go up with the Mega Blast. And get away from stuff because that buff is going to run out and you just need to Alright. So we got about two minutes left. I am going to go grab it. Maybe. Did I grab the card? Not yet. Okay. I won't grab the card. Not going to grab it yet. That's fine. So I'm going to stand next to it. Or the uni quest. All right, let's, let's go to the uni quest. Even though they don't need help with it, it's just an excuse to walk across the map. Nothing but net. Kick the balls into the goal. Now you see the goals on the screen. Um, you take a ball and you just start walking it that way, just like that. Got it. All right. Uh, let's see. 10% increased movement speed. Increases and decreases your movement speed are also added to your damage. So we're at 240% damage. 448% damage now? I think I just broke the game. Shit. Okay, we probably want to... Yeah, I was going to say, we probably want to pick up these cards. I'm going to go get the other one because at 15 minutes, you're locked into a small area on the map. And you can't really leave that area because uh, if you ever played a battle royale, everything turns into like poison. And you're you're stuck in that area. Or you can go out into the poison area and uh, basically die really quick. Okay, we just evolved the... Uh, now it's a rapid rabbit brain game. Oh, that trial just came up. We gotta do it, we gotta do it, we gotta do it. Go, go, go. You get a hell of a lot of XP if we do it and a buff. I can make it over. I can make it over there alive! Okay, I'm gonna go. Run. Okay, well, that wall I was telling you about, it's spawning a wall right now. You see it? That thing. Like, if you get in there, I'm dead from that way. Like, if you get in there, then, uh, that's not a good thing. Alright, let's go. Video, let's. Very, very high. Let's go down to medium, right in the middle. See what that does for us. I mean, it looks the same to me. You can tell a little bit that it's like 
you know, not fully crystal clear, but it's pretty damn close. And I'm gonna wait to grab this until like, I don't know, we'll grab it. Movement speed. Okay, how's my FPS? I feel choppy. Yeah, look, look how I'm moving. I mean, I know my movement speed is sky high right now, but I'm not moving fluidly whatsoever. <sighs> Alright, we're level 36. Rare is the boss. He's right here. I don't know if this one locks you into an area. Rare might not lock you into an area. Most bosses lock you into a small portion of the map. Yep, here it is. See the wall? Don't go through this. Come on, Rare. He's just going to be missing my own. Yeah. She knocked me back. I'm waiting for these things to go away. She knocked me back into into like a couple mobs. That's why I'm on the deck. All right, where are we at? We're over here. Okay. I'm just trying to stay. It is full build. We got gold. Oh yeah. She's dead. She's really dead. Alright, well. That was uh Swarm. A lot of fun. But thank you guys so much for watching. And I will uh see you in the next video. Bye-bye.